Hello everyone, hope you all are doing great. In this video, I am going to explain the concept of coordinate covalent bond. So let us consider the formation of ammonium ion. So when there is a reaction between two colorless gases, which is ammonia and which is ammonia and hydrogen chloride, a thick white smoke of solid is formed that is ammonium chloride. So uh, to understand this equation, to understand the formation of ammonium ion, we need to draw a Lewis structure. And even I strongly encourage you to draw Lewis structure, then only we can able to find the lone pair. We can able to find the number of lone pair in a molecule. So let us move on to the ammonia molecule here. So here we have one nitrogen and the three atoms of a hydrogen. The nitrogen uh, comes under group 15 in the periodic table. Hence the valence number of nitrogen is 5. So look, look at this picture. We can count here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 electrons which are represented in a red color. They are the valence electron of nitrogen. So we can see 3 unpaired electron and 1 paired electron. So to make the stable, to make it stable, the 3 atoms of hydrogen comes and attach it to the nitrogen. Then the molecule will be the stable will become the stable molecule because it completes the octet structure. We can count here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So nitrogen has 8 at 8 electron and hydrogen has duplex, is in duplex state. We can see two electrons, the sharing between nitrogen and hydrogen. So this is the ammonia molecule. So the electron which are participating in the bonding the electrons which are participating in the bonding are called the bonding pair electron. So this electron we called as a bonding pair electron. And the unpaired electron which is on the outermost shell are called lone pair electron. Lone pair electron. So I hope by this till now you have understood I think. So when the ammonium ion. So here as we can see that ammonium NH4 plus are formed by the transfer of hydrogen ion which is simply a proton. From the hydrogen chloride molecule to the lone pair of electron on the ammonium molecule. So now the ammonium uh, NH4 plus which is nothing but the ammonium cation is formed but where does the dative bond will form? Yes, I'll tell you listen here when the NH4 plus ion is formed the fourth hydrogen is attached. The Listen carefully the fourth hydrogen is attached by a dative covalent bond. So here the, our coordinate bond will form between the nitrogen and the fourth atom of hydrogen. In ammonia we can see plus positive charge that is because only the hydrogen nucleus is transformed. Here we can see only hydrogen nucleus is transferred from the chlorine to nitrogen hence we get the plus sign and the hydrogen electron which is present representing in the green color is left behind on the chlorine to form a negative chloride ion. So in the ammonium ion when the fourth hydrogen is the fourth hydrogen atom is attached by a dative covalent bond or we can say coordinate covalent bond 
and coordinate covalent bond is shown by an arrow mark you can see here and the, this arrow mark is pointing from the donor atom to the acceptor atom next we want we will move on to the formation of a hydronium ion here we can see the same thing the see the lewis structure of water when the hydrogen chloride is dissolving in water we can get the h3o plus hydronium ion and cl minus ion so this hydronium ion can also be called as oxonium ion or hydroxonium ion so when the hydrogen chloride is dissolved in water we will get the hydronium ion so let us consider the lewis structure of this equation so here we can see the lewis structure of a h2o molecule so oxygen comes under group 16 hence the valency number of oxygen is 6 so we can see here 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 we have 6 electron in the outermost shell of oxygen so to complete the octet structure we have two atoms of hydrogen and that also in the duplex state hydrogen so to get the hydronium ion a hydrogen ion is transferred from the chlorine to one of the lone pair of electron on the oxygen atom so in oxygen we can see two lone pair so this hydrogen ion comes and comes in contact with the one of the lone pair of oxygen atom and thus we will get the hydronium ion.